The roof of the school's block of three classrooms was blown off by last year's November rainfall and the renovation has not started. As a result, some learners are now being temporarily taught in a tent donated by a villager. Imbili Combined School Acting Principal Hilka Huhua says teaching and learning will be constantly disrupted due to the current rains which forces them to suspend classes. It's very difficult for us to cope because now it's rainy season. The pre-primary, the grade ones, they don't have roof. Uh, the shelter now, we are now, they are just there outside. We cannot uh, teach them under the trees because it's raining. The grade nines are now in the tent. And we are now asking for good Samaritans to help us with the, maybe tents or zinc so that we can construct some uh, temporary shelters for these kids. Efforts to obtain comments from Otunganga Seket, Inspector Crespen Masule, on what's being done to ease the situation at school proved futile as his phone went unanswered. The school has a host of other challenges such as insufficient chairs and tables and the school management has now designed benches and tables for the students as remedy. However, teachers' accommodation does not have running water and a sewer system. A grade 8 learner called for the speedy solution to the predicament they face. We are asking the government to help us, help us with some summer returns, zincs and some renovation. The school, which has been in existence for 31 years, with a population of 430 learners, made headlines in 2018 when a learner who had stolen his uncle's unlicensed gun took it to class. During break time, the grade 5 learner mistakenly pulled the trigger, killing a fellow learner.